Hey guys, as long as I'm here and doing my stuff, I figured I'd make a couple more videos. Alright, so the one that I'm going to do next is called, I just call it a opposite knee tap or something. Um, it really doesn't have a name that I know of. Um, get rid of some stuff here. Okay, so for this one, you'll need an ottoman or a chair. Um, that's why I keep this little funky ottoman around. And, um, pillow is best for your head, so you probably won't be able to see my head while I'm doing this. Um, I might need to get a better, better angle. I don't know if that's going to work or not. Alright, so for this one, you're going to put your legs up on the chair or ottoman, whatever you got. Okay. And under a pillow. All right. So for this one, you're going to kick a leg up and tap it with the opposite. So you're kind of like doing a dead bug. So um, you can kind of think of it that way. So it's one, one. And you want to kick up as much as you can. Two, two, three, three, four. Four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, ten, ten. We're gonna do fifteen and then take a break. Eleven, twelve, twelve. 13, 13, 14, 14, 15, 15. Okay, so when we're taking a break, as a reminder, you want to engage your core. I don't know if you guys remember how to do it. It's not the best angle, but you want to pull in and up. So there's me just in and up. That way you can see, and when you touch it, you can tell it's tight, okay? Let's do 15 more of these. Ready? One, engage your core. One, two, two, three, three. And you want to make sure you come up a bit. Four, because you're working on your core. Four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight. Nine, nine, ten, ten, eleven, eleven, twelve, twelve, thirteen, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, fifteen. All right, this is awesome core work. Um, get myself down from here. <laughs> All right, guys, if you have any questions, let me know. Copy the scene.